Hey, it's the coach here working on a Sunday. We are moving into ProCam Chicago Fox Valley's got a space for us to put our white glove high-end printing service. Those of you may know that some of the regional photographers I print gallery grade inkjet prints for using Moab inkjet papers, which is a sponsor actually of mine. So we wanted to build a space that's away from the customer traffic so that I can do my work, but it's going to have to be color corrected, right? I am very picky about color, so forget about the iMac, that's just for billing, but, and of course forget about your laptop, that can't do all that great, but guess what's behind me? Yep, <laughs> there it is. The world's most accurate monitor, that's the self-profiling. Azo CG247. Um, how do you build an environment? And then how do you pick a white point, for instance, so that you can have ideal screen to print match? Well, first thing is get the walls a neutral gray, or you can go neutral white or neutral black if you want to, too. And believe it or not, there really are neutral whites and neutral blacks. Next, color meters. We're going to change these fluorescent lights overhead so that they are color corrected lights. And I've chosen D50, so that's the 5000K light value, you know, just because I like it better than D65. And you can only get D50 or D65, meaning color temperature is 6500K or 5000K. Now, I can blend the two of those together, let's not get complicated. But bottom line is, when I take my super duper fancy color meter and I measure the color temperature, I get, guess what? Yeah, that's right. 5080. Yep. So they have been able to create a light that is pretty darn close to 5000K. I happen to know that that meter is uh, actually super duper spot on. It actually just came out of the factory not too long ago for a recap. So you know what I do? I take my white point target for my monitor and I don't make it 5500K and I don't make it 6500K. I make it 5100K, and in fact, Azo allows me to dial it in to 5080K. That means the white point of my accurate monitor is the exact white point of my light source. So when I print a print, I hold it up next to the monitor, it matches perfectly. Now, can you do this? Of course you can. Do you need to? Probably not. If you want screen to print match, you've got to re realize that when you go to Home Depot and you buy those fluorescent lights, they're not the ones to buy. There's only one place Crockett recommends, and that's gtilight.com. Call those guys. They are the experts. When you walk into your pro lab, they probably have GTI lights in their ceiling. And so does Crockett. It's Coach here saying, when you want quality, you know, follow what we do. Everything we do is meant to be first class, right? Thanks. Bye.